Hi there, this is Kavita Sharma. I'm very excited to bring you a brand new initiative called One Concept a Day. Um, you can learn more concept if you want to, but this is a typically five minute study capsule to help you understand a concept in five to 10 minutes. So um, what is today's uh, topic? Today's topic is Net Promoter Score. This is the first topic which I'm bringing on board and expect a lot many videos which are gonna be coming through. Um, so what is Net Promoter Score? And where is this topic coming from? So most of them are taken from 2021 update. You as a project manager should know these um, to excel in your uh, project manager's life excel as a project manager or to pass the PMP exam. So what is NPS? Um, the picture which is on your screen shows some kind of survey result. Uh, so let me elaborate. NPS is a management tool to measure customer satisfaction. It is also called net promoter score. So typically NPS is, you know, you've been given surveys by companies whenever you buy a product from their website or if you go to a place. Um, the surveys are something like this. On a scale of 0 to 10, how likely is it that you would recommend your people or friends to our product or organization? Um, and you give a number to it. So typically these numbers are then evaluated and uh, there is a score breakdown and uh, categories are made. Um, people who have given a number from 0 to um, 6 are called detractors. Um, people, so what is a detractor? Detra detractor means that the person um, who has given this response is not very happy with your brand or the product. Um, seven to eight are neither satisfied nor dissatisfied. They are passive. They like your brand, but they're not going to be talking about it much. Um, so these are passive people, people who have rated you nine to 10. These are promoters. They're going to be talking good about your brand. So um, as a portfolio manager, I want my brand to succeed. People should be marketing my brand. So the one score that matters, that is a Harvard study which has come up. So in this Harvard uh, paper, it's been written that the one score which any portfolio manager needs to be concerned about is NPS. So what is NPS and how do I calculate NPS? NPS is um, person, it can be calculated by two ways. Uh, I find the second way very simple, but let me talk about both of them. Percentage of promoters divided by percentage of detractors or easier way promoters total number of promoters minus detractors divided by total response which you have got multiplied with 100. Let's um, understand it with a concept. Um, so you have uh, you know Maggie or eggy noodles did a customer loyalty check with a customer base of 100 people. The result which they have got is shown below here. Um, so there are people who have given you this score. These are what? Detractors. People who has given you this score. These are what? Passive. And people who has given you these scores are called promoters. Right? So just calculate all of that. I'm going to give a pause here for 30 seconds and then calculate it yourself. You can also click pause on the window and calculate what is the NPS for this particular brand. So let's calculate um, the NPS right away with you. Uh, how many, uh, do I need to calculate passive people? I don't. Um, how many promoters are there? So you have 25 here. How many detractors are there? So just calculate, you have 50 here. 
what is total number of respondents are 100 so you can have 25 divided by 100 is 25 percent 50 divided by 100 is what 50 percent what is the NPS NPS is total um, promoters percentage minus total detractors percentage so what do I get promoters were 25 percent minus 50% you get a score of minus 25 if I am the um, portfolio manager of this brand how would I react to this particular score it's not a good score um, if I'm the portfolio manager I need to dig deep into why people are rating me in minus do some root cause analysis and work on the next steps so thank you for listening. My name is Kavita Sharma. Um, I am reachable at kavitasharma.net. You can also write to me at kavita at kavitasharma.net. Um, if you like this video, please click on subscribe and uh, write your comments. Um, I would look forward for your feedback. Thank you very much. Have a very nice day. Bye-bye.